looks really good. Almond breeds. Here we have calcium carbonate. If you've been on my channel for a while, you know what I've been telling you about calcium carbonate. It's not actual calcium. It's a man-made compound. It's a calcium atom mixed with three carbon atoms. What do you get with that? You get shock. What happens in the human body when you put shock in the body? You get disconnection throughout the entire body. You get acidosis. You get cells not able to communicate. You get toxin build. All right, so at the very least, he should probably understand what calcium carbonate is. It is not calcium and three carbons. It's a calcium atom, a carbon atom, and three oxygen atoms. Calcium carbonate. Also, he basically just contradicts his entire argument because he's saying it's bad because it's man-made, but then he's also saying it's chalk, in which case, if it was chalk, that would actually be a natural source of calcium carbonate. And yes, it is actual calcium. Calcium is an element, and calcium is calcium, regardless of if the calcium carbonate is man-made or derived from a natural source. So there's basically two different sources of calcium carbonate that are used in foods. So one is GCC, one is PCC, so that stands for ground calcium carbonate. The other one is precipitated calcium carbonate. So ground calcium carbonate is extracted from the earth. In the precipitated form, I guess you could consider that one to be the man-made source. Both are calcium carbonate and both are the same chemical compound and both contain real, actual calcium. So there are different forms of calcium that can be added into uh, vitamin and mineral fortified products. This one is using calcium carbonate. Obviously you have things like dairy milk that have uh, calcium and there, there will be different bioavailabilities between the different compounds. Calcium carbonate is 40% elemental calcium. And there are studies showing that the calcium bioavailability of calcium carbonate is similar to that of the calcium in cow's milk. This one was specifically in soy milk. And regarding the disconnection throughout the entire body and the toxic buildup claims, of course there was no evidence presented to back those claims because they don't even make sense to begin with. Also, of course, the caption says that your best bet is to make your own, but if you make your own, it's not gonna be fortified with calcium. So if you want to make your own, that's fine, but that doesn't necessarily make it better. The only thing that's BS here is this video.